Uh, it's my pleasure now to welcome onto the stage on behalf of Toi Moana Bayfinley Regional Council, uh, Deputy Chair Councillor Jane Lee. Kia ora Tato. Well, that's a very hard act to follow, and I please uh, um, hope you forgive me for using speech notes. Um, as uh, Pim says, I'm Jane Lee, Deputy Chair of the Bayfinley Regional Council. Um, and I'd like to acknowledge all of the Rangatira dignitaries, particularly our EB leaders, um, Mayor Chadwick and Mayor Weber, who I see are here today, and a number of councillors, and apologies for anybody that I've missed. Um, I'd also like to um, note the apologies of Chairman Doug Leader um, and our Marwell Constituency Councillor, uh, Councillor Matthew Moana and McDonald, both of whom would have loved to have been here today but had official council duties to take them elsewhere. And I particularly acknowledge the words um, of Liam Smehi and Tiaretti's uh, speech, which have set the scene so well for this morning's special celebration. I also want to note the efforts of the late Pierre Kerr, Sir Peter Capsel, MP, Barry Wilkinson, Ray Bushell, Maria Horn, and many others, um, and many, um, who have worked so hard on this project for mo so many years who are here today. Um, I really acknowledge their huge efforts to bring back the Kaituna River to Makatu. We all recognise the importance of the Makatu estuary and the Kaituna River to Te Arawa, both as a landing place for the Te Arawa Waka, but also as a resource-rich food bowl for many generations. The project that we are celebrating today has its genesis in the activities of the Crown and the Regional River Board, who co-funded the 1956 cut, which diverted the Kaituna River out to sea as a drainage improvement project for agricultural development. While the effects of the 1956 and subsequent works were positive for agricultural land development, they were negative for the estuary, and in particular, Time has shown that the estuary is half filled with sand without the Kaituna River's flush and flows. Uh, most of the surrounding wetlands have disappeared. Oxygen levels in the water and estuary beds have decreased due to algal buildup and eutrophication. Shellfish and finfish populations have declined and our cultural, ecological and recreational values um, that we um, appreciate from the river and the estuary have also declined. On behalf of Toi Moana, I'm really pleased that we've been able to partner with Tuggan Whenua, the local community and J Strop Swap Contractors Limited to develop this project. And I particularly um, want to give special thanks to J Swap Contractors who have delivered an amazing performance as construction contractors. They've been flexible, efficient, and great to deal with. And I also want to recognise Pim um, and his team from the Regional Council who have worked so hard to make the project a success in partnership with EWI and the communities. Today we're going to open nine of the 12 culverts, which will bring fresh water back to Makatu. Together with restored salt marsh, the restoration of Papahi Kawe and the improved boating and public access facilities, these works will over time restore some of the cultural and ecological values of the estuary that have been lost. It's an honour to have completed this work for and with Tangat Whenua and the many people that are passionate about the estuary and the Awa that it is its lifeblood. Healthy waterways and environments are the foundation of a thriving community. This project has taken hard work, investment, and collaboration from many local people and landowners over many years. It's a great example of what can be achieved when everyone works together. Today marks a turning point for our history house, but it doesn't stop here. We've all got more work to do and many projects are already underway to keep improving water quality and wildlife habitat throughout the Kaituna catchment and deliver on the outcomes of tomorrow O Kaituna River Authority Kaituna Action Plan. 
We're looking forward to seeing the birds, the fish and the people enjoy a healthier hour and estuary in the future and seeing the next generation to continue the work that we're celebrating the progress of today. So thank you and I hope you will enjoy a wonderful celebration.